Hello truckers and welcome to the demo version of Snow Plowing Simulator brought to you by Free Mind Games. This game will be coming out later in 2023. What's later in 2023? I don't know, tomorrow, uh, December of 2023. Those dates are both later. But anyways, we're going to look at the demo version today. I've already been to the game, gave it a try. That way I kind of know exactly what I'm doing and I uh, can kind of breeze through this kind of at a decent pace for us. Uh, start a new game. Ah, here we go. Inside our very own garage here. Uh, we'll walk around here. Trying to get rid of some of the stuff that uh, you go through in a tutorial. Upper left-hand corner, we have a calorie counter. That's right, because we're going to be doing some physical work. So we're going to be burning through the calories. So we're going to have to keep an eye on that. If we're burning calories, that means we got to intake calories. We'll show you that in just a moment. Also in the upper left-hand corner, you can see it is our body temperature is 36.6 degrees centigrade. We'll have to keep our eye on that because we'll be working outside. Don't want to catch a cold or a fever, which you can do, uh, and we might do. I'll probably just do it just to show you if I don't happen to do it uh, by working outside. So anyways, over here, we got ourselves a, oh yeah, we got electric kettle for tea. We got a coffee maker over here for hot coffee. That's, of course, to give us energy and, of course, to warm us on up. Uh, let's go over here to our computer. Let's go ahead and buy ourselves a shovel because we're going to need that. And we're going to have to wait for that to be delivered. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and buy that. So they do give us, uh, well, it says 300. It must have had 350, but it's in delivery. Maybe we'll take away the $50 after it's been delivered. Wasn't paying too much attention to that uh, in the beginning anyways. Uh, so right now, the only thing we got is a small spade that we can buy. We will unlock a, a one more thing or maybe two more things in this uh, demo. I think it's only one. Uh, over here, we have plows. Um, everything's going to be too expensive and... You can see everything's locked. I'm not going to be able to get to any of this today. Uh, over here, we do got clothing. So we're currently wearing a thin sweater, which is good up to, well, 5 degrees centigrade and max temperature up to 15. So if, I guess if it gets above 15, it uh, I get too hot and I probably can get sick just as well. Um, you can see we get uh, clothes all the way down to the Alpine, which is $750, we'll just say. For minimum temp temperature, minus 30 degrees centigrade, max temperature zero. Uh, so, yeah, there's clothing you can buy. Uh, Power-up. Shops and restaurants supply power-up are open at different times. Therefore, the assortment in the online store changes frequently. Uh, we'll be using this. Well, it's not going to show me anything currently, but items will show up there. Uh, so, other items that we can buy. Cough syrup. Uh, so when you start catching a cold, you're going to have to drink some of that. Uh, hand cream, this is good for up to minus 10 degrees, and this hand cream is good up to minus 25 degrees. Uh, of course, we can buy coffee and tea. We'll go ahead and buy the tea. That will be immediately put on your table. That doesn't say delivered. It says uh, coffee table. Uh, aspirin for when you get a fever. And a thermal. So I guess uh, you know if you're not at the office working and you're snow shoveling someone's driveway or sidewalk, uh, having a thermos with you would be kind of good. Uh, power up? No. Let me go ahead in here. Well, I hope something shows up <laughs> later on because I'm going to need it. Uh, there's our electric kettle. There is our tea. Uh, that horn means the carrier has brought in our shovel. So, hooray. Um, here is the map currently. Now, unfortunately, through the demo... Uh, we're not going to be able to actually leave the premises. I, you know, they haven't gotten that far yet, I guess, or want us to get that far. Uh, let's go into, well, it says private room, but, um, darn, I don't know where I lost my key. Uh, so it's somewhere. Uh, let's go into the garage. Sounds like I just kicked the door on open. Uh, yeah, some posters on the wall there. We'll just skip through that. Nothing, nothing too bad, but, uh, yeah, don't be kind of showing that. So if you do buy cough medicine and aspirins, um, you'll find them in here, and when I found out when I was first going through, the second you get a cough, you take the cough medicine, the cough goes away, or if you get a fever, the second you take an aspirin, your fever goes away and you start feeling better. Uh, this is your vehicle right here, but if I click on it, I don't know where the keys are, um, so that's great. Uh, you can open these doors here. I didn't actually try this one yet, but I'm sure that one opens. Uh, we'll leave the doors open. It doesn't matter. It's not like the cold air is going to rush in. We're going to stay warm in here. So the first couple jobs or the only jobs we're going to be able to do is taking care of our driveway to the gate and the sidewalk out to that gate. And if I press, uh, not outside, but if I press Q, it highlights the area that I need to shovel. 
All right, let's come over here and grab the shovel. Hey, we got ourselves a shovel. If I hit one on the keyboard, you can see the shovel where it needs to go, where it's going to be highlights on up and we need to be over here. So if I just go, yes. So if I just start like right here, now if I just press and hold the left mouse button, it'll keep shoveling and going forward. You can see in the upper right hand corner, the percentage of the sidewalk that we got done. And then if I keep it highlighted, if you press and hold Q while, while you shovel, you can kind of see where you need to go. So in the upper left hand corner, you can kind of see my temperature's down to 36.3 and you got a snowflake on it. So I'm getting a little bit too cold. So I'll just come back in here, warm right on up. All right, we are fine. Let's go back out here, get our shovel back out. And what I figured out the first time I went through, once I get the edges done, then I don't have to press and hold Q to find out the area I need to shovel. If I get both edges done and just work in the middle to the sides and we're all set. So in the letterbox you can check what task you have and report to report the uh, execution of the order to the client. All right, I'm going to run back up here, just dive back in here for a bit. All right, we're nice and warm again. Now every time I go inside the shovel uh, goes back into my inventory, so you got to keep taking it back out, which is not that big of a deal. You can see I'm burning through my calories. I just kind of hope that the uh, store's not bugged out, because I was going to buy some food and put it in my inventory, so that way I had it, so when I need to eat something, we're good to go. But uh, nothing was popping up, so I hope that that solves itself. I don't know what happens if I go hungry, but that's something we can try, I guess. There, so now that I got the sides done, I can kind of just work on up on either side. And we'll get the job done. Now, you'll see there's a green glow on the ground in front of us. Wait until you see what pops up here. Let me go ahead and put the shovel away. Uh, I just found some money, $500. Someone lost some money. Now you think, you know, what kind of person am I? Uh, we're going to keep it. That's, <laughs> we don't, I, there's not an option for that. Just uh, $500 goes into our inventory. Let's see, I'm starting to get it a little bit cold. You got to be careful because it's not like much of a warning. Once it goes red, you're, you're kind of sick. Uh, let's run back inside quickly. All right, I'm all set. This actually, I didn't notice that before. It looks like a heater. Uh, where did I find that light switch for in here? I think it was over here. They do flicker a bit like fluorescent lights would. Uh, let me go back in here and see if I can buy some food. And actually, let me turn the outside light on because I'm working outside. We'll turn the inside light on as well. Uh, power up. Ah, oh, there we go. So the bang for the buck that I was uh, at least seeing currently um, would be the croissant. Adds 700 calories for basically a dollar. And I can hold up to five in my inventory. Uh, you can see there's other things that, you know, give you a lot of calories. But at $7, that's 800 calories. $7 for 800 calories. I'd rather get 700 calories for a dollar. Let's go ahead and we're going to buy five of those. And they go right into my inventory. I don't have to wait for anything to, to uh, arrive. Um, I wonder now. I didn't check the first time. But can if I go to closed. 768. Can I buy that? No. It's not going to let me buy any of the new clothing to stay warmer longer. It might be kind of like a level up thing. Maybe I got to level up before I can buy other types of clothing or something. Uh, but either way. Let's get the shovel back out. Snow shoveling in the nighttime is always better than snow shoveling in the daytime, in my opinion. I don't know why. Maybe it's just me. I'll tell you one thing, though. I'm doing a better job than I did my first time in the demo, ver uh, the demo version. 
in my first demo version, I was uh, kind of struggling getting some stuff done. But then I learned to hold down the mouse button and uh, we'll take care of it. It is kind of tedious. It says uh, 99.7 done. Oh, it's got to be this part up here will get us done. Nine point eight, nine nine point nine, a hundred percent. All right, uh, let's go. Uh, well, before I do, let me just go, jump in here quickly. We'll get nice and warm. All right, we're gonna head out here to the mailbox and clearing the path to the office entrance. Uh, do you want to try to pass the job? You cleared the snow one hundred percent in four twenty. Four twenty, really. Uh, 100% done. So I'm not getting paid for that. It just says level passed. Um, I guess that's our address. And uh, now customers can easily come to your office. Congratulations. There's still snow removal for the from the driveway to the garage gates. Just by a more powerful tool. Well, it's not a snow plow. Uh, let's go on inside. Let's go back to the store. And now you can see it has unlocked for us a bigger shovel. Uh, we can't get the medium shovel, and we can't get the electric snowblower. So that, that kind of is uh, not great. But uh, we'll go ahead and get this shovel right here for 160 This will go ahead and be in delivery. So while we're waiting, let's go ahead and we'll click on the electric kettle. So, yep, do you want to drink tea now? It'll keep you warm. Yep, we'll go ahead and do that. Uh, I didn't see if my calories went up, but that delivery guy was quick with that shovel, wasn't he? Uh, let's go into my inventory and let's go ahead and have those croissants. I'm going to eat them all. And now my calories have gone up. We are nice and warm. Let's come outside and get our other shovel, our brand new shovel. All right, so now we got a bigger shovel. Now if I hit Q again, now you can see, yeah, we got a bigger area to cover. Uh, let me go ahead and shove this door. And now I hit the two key. This will go with the bigger shovel. And if I can get it to where... It's blue. Now I'll just push it straight across. And dump it there. Now, you definitely got to dump it off of the, uh, the driveway because if you dump it back on the driveway, all that snow goes right back on in there. And it'll add to the total. When I first saw this job, I actually, the first time I did it, I started doing it with the other shovel and it took, it was taking me forever. And I went back in to get warm and when I was uh, just trying to get warm, that's why I clicked out. I'm like, oh, some stuff unlocked. Cool. All right, for the fun of the game, I'm going to stay out here too long and we're going to catch ourselves a cold and a fever. So you can see my body temperature is down to 36. It's actually starting to flash. I did not notice that the first time. I probably just wasn't paying attention to it. Now I did drink some tea, so I don't know if that's keeping me warmer longer or not. I think I gotta drop down, I don't know, 35 degrees body temperature before I catch a cold. I kind of like how this game is starting off. It's not like this, you know, buy a truck, buy a snow plow, and you're snow plowing. It's pretty much like uh, you got to earn some cash before you can get yourself a snow plow. I'm not even sure if uh, we can hook a snow plow up to our truck. Uh, yeah, you can start to see a little bit of frost on the corner of the monitor or the screen, which means I'm getting kind of cold. I'm wondering, I know we're going to find something here soon. I just forgot where it's going to be. Yeah, they're pretty much forcing you to do these jobs because, you know, finding the $500 on the sidewalk didn't take that long for me to get there. 
I don't remember getting the frost on my screen the first time I played when I got sick. I just got sick, and I was like, okay. Not much of a warning there. It's hard and slow to walk in high snow. I don't remember all the frost on my screen the first time. Am I going far enough with the snow? Ooh, not not really. Uh, I can clean up that side later on. Okay, but I gotta realize I gotta go a little bit further than I've been going. Right, maybe I'll go inside, because I thought I would have been sick by now, but it could have been because I drank the tea. Let me go back inside here. As our body temperature rises. Now, as I was colder, I went through my calories a lot faster. Uh, let's go ahead back to the store. Uh, let's power up. So, some of the stores are closed tonight. Uh, so, what will be down to here? Uh, I guess, let's get some chips. Sure, why not? And let's go ahead and have something to eat. All right, let me go back outside. And, oh, no, I, I, I was outside too long. So my body temperature went up kind of quick. So yeah, uh, you can hear me coughing. And my temperature is in the red, which means I got a fever. Uh, let's go to items. Let's go ahead and buy that. Some cough syrup. And we'll buy some aspirin as well. All right, so I'm not coughing anymore. So that's that was a quick cough. Um, so there's a cop at us and give me, no, I'm still coughing. Never mind. Hang on. We'll take that. <laughs> all right. Uh, okay. So that we're all set there. And if I take one aspirin, boom, body temperature is fixed and my cough is gone. If it was only like that in real life, right? Uh, that, that'd be great. No, no, I don't want that shovel. No, hang on a second. I want this shovel. There we go. Now, it says I could uh, tab and hand over the job to someone else, but I don't want to do that. Because if I do that, I don't know if I'll get what I'm hoping I'll find here shortly. Seventy percent done. Once the snow gets a certain depth where I live, uh, I don't shovel it either. <laughs> Go ahead and use a snow blower. I used to help my uncle back in the day when uh, he had a snow plowing business. So I'm kind of excited to see what we got uh, to work with here. Once uh, they release more of the game. Did I miss it? I'm thinking I missed what I'm looking for here. I haven't seen it yet. It's not more money. Am I going far enough? I am going far enough. Right, let me go back inside. Yeah, I'll probably stay outside too long. I'll probably get a cold again. Uh, let me go drink some tea. All right, and let's get something to eat. Do we have croissants again? Because are they open? Uh, they're not open. Chocolate cake, 5,000 calories. Yeah, sure. Why not? Yeah, that should get us through. Right, 
head back outside, get out our snow shovel again. See if we can finish this off. Still haven't found what I'm looking for. Alright, so where do I got a cover here? I can't shovel there. Uh, let me get the other shovel. You can see you got a little bit of a green thing there. And there it is. That's what I'm looking for. Can I get the key? There we go. Yep, we got the key. There we go. All right, now let's get this back out. There, now can I finish this? Uh, where am I missing... Oh, I got all this stuff up here, huh? Well, I don't want to die here if I caught a cold again. Yes, we'll take that. And we'll take that. And back outside, see if I can finish up this little pieces that we got left. 99% done. Let me try to get the last little bit done here. Well, it looks like when you go without any calories, um, you just work very slowly. And I mean very slowly here. But I only need 0.1% more. I thought that would do it. But apparently not. Let, let me go ahead and grab something to eat. If I can. Oh, I'm getting cold again as well. Yeah, I can hardly move. Alright, uh, what can we buy now? Uh, I don't know. Let's uh, get some donuts maybe? Those don't provide much. But it might be enough to get me through. Uh, my body temperature is not going up well, but there it goes. A little bit of coffee will do, or a little bit of tea will do it. All right, I gotta find this uh, last 0.1%, wherever it might be. Finally, the last uh, <laughs> the last 0.1% is done. Now let's head over to the mailbox here. And yes, took me 11 minutes, 28 seconds. That's with eating and all that other stuff. But now we are all set. Uh... Well, I had to do it all over again. A little heads up. If you leave the property at any time, it ends a demo. Uh, I came over here after I completed that. I'm like, oh, I can open the gate. Maybe I can just walk through it. Because uh, the first time I played it, I drove through it and end the demo. Uh, walking through the gate will end the demo just as well. Uh, so I got the driveway done. I'm not fully done, uh, but I guess you can clear it and you're fine. I don't know what the percentage is. When I did sidewalk, I got to like 70%. I tried ending the sidewalk job and it wouldn't let me do it. So I'm guessing maybe above 75% if you want to try it. But um, so our sidewalk and our driveway is cleared. So we got the key. Let me go ahead and shut the door. So I had to do it all over again so I could at least show you what the private room was all about. Uh, but before I do that, though, I kind of forgot as well. There is a weather station here and it kind of gives you the temperature uh, reading for the next few hours. And let's see, it just says snow. And I guess this is how much snow we're supposed to be getting. I think. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, maybe. 
Uh, maybe that's what that is. All right, so you got a weather station here. And now the private room, because we got the key. Let's go ahead and open the door and turn on the light. So we can come in here. Can I shut the door while I'm in here? There we go. Uh, I didn't shut the door last time. Can I play with the mop? Nope. I didn't check nothing here before. So over here, we got a book to my story. You will learn the whole mysterious story of the town and the surrounding area when you get all the artifacts for the board. Um, Sasquatch, uh, maybe. Part of it. Uh, where's a good picture of the... You can kind of... Bottom of the snowman, Sasquatch, whatever you want to call them. Kind of see a little pinning there. Um, there is a radio here. There is music. I'm not going to play the music because I, I played the music on Forest Ranger Simulator and that was copyrighted. So um, you do have different radio stations that you can listen to while you travel around. But there is the pickup keys. Hey, we got the pickup keys. Congratulations. Uh, microwave we can't use. Uh, just a pizza box. I guess there's nothing in there. And yeah, this is our little... <laughs> This is our little office. Oh, I got I got a cold. Uh, I didn't know I sealed there, there too long. I'm not sure what all these codes are. I'm sure it'll be for something. Uh, warehouse, storage room, PBR, workflow. Uh, yeah, I got a whole bunch of that stuff there. So I don't know what all that stuff means. Here, let me go ahead and take care of my uh, wonderful car for like the last minute here. There we go. Uh, so yeah, we can just get in the car and drive, but not too far. Uh, one thing I did find out on this time around, uh, before when I was buying food, I was, I was only buying one item at a time because it would say buy and then I was buying it and then it would say full pocket. Um, that means like if I exit on out and go into here, I have five pockets. So you can uh, stack up five different type of foods and go on your merry way. Nope, wrong button. I want to go in here. Not that I need to. Hamburger. All pockets occupied. Uh, there we go. So let's go ahead and jump into the pickup truck. I tried my steering wheel on this. Uh, but yeah, the steering wheel was a no-go. So yeah, we can hop into our pickup truck here. And pretty much drive forward. Gates will automatically open. Uh, let's see. L to turn the lights on or off. All right, so you can tell they're on or off by just looking at the interior because lights are on or off. Uh, hazardous lights are also L. And C to switch the camera. All right, can we uh, do this? So, well, I guess the roof lights don't quite work. Oh, we can kind of see our character for the first time. Sort of. And those are the camera angles we have. But the second we go out the door... Whoop. Okay, you want to reopen there, please? There we go. And the second we go on out... Boom! We're done with the demo. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, the first time when I was in, a, I had to do a long jump cut because I had to take it the sidewalk and the driveway again. Uh, when I completed the driveway with you guys, I was like, oh, I can go out the gate. And I, the second I walked out the gate, I got this. And I had to do it all over again. So I can at least show you the private room and whatnot. But there is Snow Plowing Simulator by Free Mind Games. It'll be coming out later in 2023. Don't know when. Uh, but I am looking forward to this game quite a bit. So when it comes out, I definitely will be giving it a little bit of a let's play. I got some Snow Plowing Company names in my head. Uh if we get to do that kind of a thing. But if I can bring in more than the demo in the future before the game comes out, you'll definitely see it here. So keep track of that. But this was Snow Plowing Simulator, the demo version. But that will do it for today, guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the episode. I do appreciate you watching as always. And I'll catch you again at some time back in Snow Plowing Simulator. But until then, have a good one.